just real quick, we're gonna hear at the end of the video, but Highway 18, the whole stretch is open again. Highway 38, the whole thing is open again. So you can get in and out of town from all over. You just can't take the, high, the 330, but you'll hear the cops tell me this at the end of the video. All right, enjoy the video, guys. Thanks again for all the support. Hey, how's it going, everybody? It's September 15th, 2024. This is another update from the Big Bear perspective of this fire, the line fire. As you can see over there, it's not looking so bad, but then you come back across here and it's getting, I mean, it's, it's nasty again. I just got back up from Apple Valley doing my, doing my thing to help get this visual information to the people who are evacuated so you know what it's like and make the decision whether you want to come out, come back up here to uh, be in the smoke or not. But yeah, it's, it's, it's absolutely horrible over here. Right now, we're gonna be driving through the area that was blocked off due to the evacuation order. I'm inter interested to see this side of town and just how bad the smoke is over here. From down the mountain, seeing the big plume of smoke and it blowing over, it was blowing right into this area. <clears throat> I'm really hoping we get some wind changes here because uh, I'm telling you, on the right side of the big smoke plume, it was the most beautiful blue skies. But yeah, we're already into the evacuation, or what was the evacuation zone. We have no more evacuation zones up here. Or, sorry, evacuation orders. But yeah, it's just so nasty. So nasty, yo. We're at 36% containment. 38,421 acres have been burned so far. But yes, this area we are going through was just where the evacuation order was lifted. I know a lot of people are missing their homes right now. Trust me, I get it. I'm gonna be going back down though because this smoke is, for me, a little bit much, but I saw some, some people outside jogging <laughs> and riding their bikes and stuff. It's like, these people up here are tough. I'll tell you what, these people up here are super tough. But yeah, we are driving towards the fire now. Hope everyone's having a having a good day. Again, I must stress my pride in the firefighters who have just been kicking this fire's butt and protecting so much property and lives. It's just remarkable. All of you deserve way more pay than you already get. I know some of you make pretty damn good money, but you deserve way more money. Yeah, I don't believe that. Horrible. We're gonna drive out to our Big Bear Dam so you guys can uh, see what it's like at the furthest point where Highway 18 is closed. But now we're driving through Boulder Bay. Boulder Bay is a big beautiful neighborhood in the Big Bear Lake part of this area. Boulder Bay State, or not State Park, just Boulder Bay Park. It's usually a really beautiful place for people to come and chillax and enjoy their time up here in beautiful Big Bear. I can't wait till all of this is done with so you guys can come up here and enjoy the town. Without you guys coming up here, our town does not survive. We are a tourist-based town. So we need you to come up here and take a load off, spend a few bucks, and just have a great time. 
But yeah, this whole area that we're driving through now until yesterday was mandatory evacuations and they had it completely secure, which again, I think is just wonderful. I'm very, very grateful for all the police as well as the, as the firefighters for keeping our town safe from evildoers. close this this fire has come to our little town here it started all the way down at the bottom of the mountain which is pretty amazing how far these fires can travel watch out little birdie watch out birdie birdie We are almost to the road closure. Not really a great view right there. We're getting too much reflection. Look at all these firefighters. You guys rock. You guys absolutely rock. Got a few thumbs up back from a few of them. So in my portion of town, which is Moon Ridge area, basically the center of the valley, um, it's, it's really smoky right now. But it seems like over here it's getting a little bit better. Except to our to our west, I believe it would be our west, or maybe uh, northwest. I'm not sure. I always get so turned around here. All right. Well, here we are at the Big Bear Dam. What is going on here? Did they open the road? No way. We're just going to take a little trek. No way. I swear I just saw it still closed. From the Big Bear Dam to uh, Jerupa or something like that. Take a quick little jump over here. Oh yeah, you, 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 you can see it all right down there. Zoom in. But it's kind of a white smoke, so I'm, I'm, I'm thinking that's from them dousing it like crazy. Gosh, you guys and gals are doing such a great job. I am so proud of you guys. Okay, so this is coming into town. I don't... Uh, I'm going to stop the video for a second and see if the police officer will let me ask him a question on, on, on video. He probably won't, but it doesn't hurt to try. You know what? He's probably not going to let me... Uh, much here but I just want to at least thank him or her I know it's a horrible camera view how's it going just want to thank you guys you guys have made it easy for us who evacuated to not have to worry so much 
Uh, you, you, you guys get way little credit for what you guys do, and, and I'm, I, I totally back you guys for sure. Thank you. And when was this open? Two o'clock today? So all the way down? 18 the whole way? And, oh, okay, and the 38. Thanks, guys. Stay safe. Thank you. All right, that was really cool, guys. There, what, what a bunch of cool dudes, man. So, yeah, Highway 38's open. Highway 18's open. We're getting this place back up and running, folks. It was yellow. It was not red when I just went through, just so you know. Yeah, anyway, this is what we're working with. Thank you guys for joining us here. Thank you for all the love and support, especially all the people who don't live around here who have been leaving the most amazing comments and taking time out of your day to show this whole area love. We appreciate it very much. We love you right back. And uh, yeah, probably be doing another video tomorrow. I can't wait till I don't have to make any more videos. The last video I want to make is driving through these areas where we can see what actually happened. But until then, all of you have a great rest of your day. And keep your thoughts and prayers going for all the firefighters. Take care.